2,000 years later. Hey guys, sorry for the weird intro, but this video is going to be a bit of a different video. Not that different, but just different. By unusual, I mean my old art. I was pretty good. Correction, I am good. Sorry if my lighting's bad. I've been trying to test it as much as I can, but I'm trying to get that thing up. Oh, you can't see it. Um, yeah, but it's kind of hard to set it all up and get it just right so my face is all not weird. So what I like to draw is, well, I like to draw. I used to draw a lot, but uh, I drew this. Here, I'll get a better view. Hang on. Okay, now this isn't really art. But I drew like the stat, like the things of all the, so Mercury, um, it's, the radius of it is 1500 miles. I just drew all the like, spat, like the stats, so, not stats, but like all the things of the um, planets. So Saturn, um, one year, one Earth year there was 29 years. And yeah, I also drew some of the dwarf planets, like Ceres, Luna the sun um here this is my next one sorry for the shade but this is a theory of what i drew um it's a really accurate theory so if an asteroid hit the moon the moon might fall into earth's um, atmosphere and rip the moon all apart so the moon would be flying around the earth by gravitational pull and it would just keep pulling around pulling around and it would split up so we would have Earth rings, just like that's like Saturn, and um, yeah, they it. Whenever a planet has rings, um, it, they're all rocks spinning really fast. So that's what would happen with the moon. Um, yeah, here's my next one. This is one of the favorite drawings I've ever done in my life. I really like it. So I drew the sun right here, and I use these like cool markers. They're cool. So here's Mercury, Venus, it's a lot better in person, Earth, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, uh, it's not really a circle though, Uranus, and Neptune. But it just looks really nice all together, and I just really like it. Like how I did all the stars, it's just my favorite ever. So um, at the end of this video, comment down your favorite piece. Here, this is called the um, Moon Theory. This is called the planets, just the planets. And I drew this. This was really scratch paper for that to find out what the colors were. But I actually think it ended up really cool, sort of. So it looks like a ton of exoplanets, if you know what that means. Just look it up. Um, like just other planets that telescopes have found. But there's like all these different squiggly planets. So just call it random planets. I actually really like it. I know what I'm gonna draw, but it's a secret. But it's a secret until I'm done. So, please hold again. Now watch what I did while I wait and draw this. Watch what I did at the basketball court. It's pretty cool. Just hey. shoot it. <laughs> that was close. Oh, I forgot to hit record. <laughs> Whoa! Oh, that was awesome. Great follow-up shot. Guys, I just finished. I love it. And I hope you guys like it too. Here you go. Bam. Seriously took about 30 minutes. Um, I was going to draw 50 of these guys, but that itself took about 25. But yeah, this is gold by the way, not black. It kind of looks black, but gold, gold, underlining is gold, that's black. So I said, you guys are the best, number one. And you guys are seriously, seriously amazing. So I drew 20 guys times 
50 subs is my summer goal. One second, I'm gonna add something. There we go, I wrote summer goals right there. So 50 subs is the summer goal. I'm definitely gonna be hanging this up there. I'm gonna draw something else. So please hang on. 2,000 years later. So what I drew was, I did draw this. So it's just like aces for the expressions of so subs. But then I thought, I'm gonna make a goal graph. My goal for the end of 2018 is a thousand subscribers. I don't know how I'm gonna do it, but I think I can. I mean, some people have gotten a million and a half, like Morgs. He's like my biggest inspiration. I'll do a whole other video about him um, and all my inspirations, but he's like my biggest inspiration. He's just so amazing to watch. So it goes by that, that, that. Under there, I put a description and box of um, what I'm gonna do and then a checkbox. Um, so right here, I'm gonna do a big giveaway. I don't know what big giveaway we're talking about, but really big, really big compared to um, the $10 summer giveaway. So remember to subscribe right now for $10, for a chance to get $10 this summer. It's just, 75 is my goal for the end of the summer, or 50 if we can't get there. Right now we're at 37, even though I had 38 but then lost one. This, I'm gonna put this on my wall for goals. I'll be done, I'll be back when I'm done. Bam, done. I'm gonna add to the list, be right back. Done, so what I added is at 100 subscribers, if you guys want me to, I'll get a P.O. box, so if you want to send me stuff. I know it sounds ridiculous, but a ton of YouTubers are doing it because, like, when you have a lot of fans, people want to send you, like, letters and stuff. But, yeah, I'm going to maybe get a P.O. box. I think it's only, like, $30 a year, but as of right now, I'll just spend anything. Seriously, this camera was $200, and I did it just for YouTube. Money is not a thing. I'll save. I'm saving for a... $1,500 MacBook right now, so I can edit my videos better for your guys' experience. So, right here, I'll 75% get a, a P.O. box, and right here, I will almost for sure get a P.O. box at 200 subs. Also, when we get when we hit 100, I'm going to do a big giveaway. Not like a 1,000, but like a big giveaway. Like, bigger than $10, but yeah, you guys just mean everything to me, so... I'll seriously do anything to make that happen. So yeah, my goal for this video um, is going to be 5 likes. My other video's got like 15, 10, it's just amazing. Thank you for everything. So this is where I'm going to end this video. Um, I really hope you liked it. Remember to complete that goal, go down and subscribe. Um, I gotta clean this mess up. Uh, it's gonna take a year. Peace out.